Hello YouTube world, this is Johnny Mo coming to you today with a setup review. This is my 2021 setup review. We've started about two weeks ago. Uh, I got the trailer, trailer re-lettered. This is my new logo. Uh, didn't do anything drastically different, but the trailer got re-lettered. That's the new logo. Here's the new yard signs. Um, so we're going for a fertilizing setup. This is the Permagreen. Uh, ground logic. I'm sorry, not a permagreen. This is the Ferris Pathfinder. So I did this in my last video. We're running with the steel backpacks, uh, the 800. Um, this is new to me. It is not new. This is the X Mark Laser X, as you can see, the X series. This is my backup mower. I, I sold the stander. Uh, this would be cutting my lawn, and then if my Toro goes down, then this goes into the trailer. Uh, it has about 2,000 hours on it, and it runs really good. It runs really good. Cuts really great. It's obviously, it's an Xmark Ultra Cut 4 deck. I'm not going to say too much about it. It's just a backup mower. I don't care if I use it or if I don't use it. You know, whatever it is, it is. Um, so we're still running my push spreader, still the Andersons, 2200. The Andersons, still the best push spreader on the market. Still running the RBG 712. We have the Milwaukee stuff. Um, so let's go into the trailer. Um, as you see, it's got relettered. The new logo, let me know what you think of the new logo. Just updated the logo. Um, we're running with the Ford 2019 Ford F-250 uh, Still running strong. No issues. We have the easy dumper on it uh, Going good. I put the sides on uh, to make it higher so we can hold quite a bit of mulch in there uh, Here's my other ground logic. Here's my still still using the, the hand cans and um, This ground logic is my older one, I was using it yesterday. Um, still using fuel works for the main mower, gas cans. So meaning um, if I need to dispel a lot of gas quickly, I use that. As you can see, every single one of these nozzles has broke off again. Um, you know, some will say, Jen, you're just hard on things. Nope, that's a flaw. I'm not warranting them. I don't care. Uh, I don't use them for for any kind of like I'm not going to use these to fill up two cycles. It's just it's too it's too much of a gush. Um, I use I went back to these to fill up. Um, that actually has rec fuel on it, 91 rec fuel. This is my two cycle. Um, these are for my big mowers. If I want to dispel gas fast, that's what the fuel works good for. Uh, that's my favorite can. Just just the short. That's not the short can. That's the no spill can. Um, going with the 56 C's this year, I uh, still got Milwaukee as a backup. The Milwaukee, what I found last year after having used it my second full year, what I found with the Milwaukee is that the blade tip slowed way down. And I don't know what that was from. Maybe it's just, you know, got a little bit older, but I've trimmed a lot of shrubs with that. It could do it. It just... The times were taking too long on the properties. And after about 10 properties, I'm looking at the times. I'm like, man, something's wrong. So I went and borrowed my buddy's 56 C's. I trimmed the next property and my times were right back on schedule. And so I went and bought that and my properties began, be, began to be more uh, time efficient. I was losing time using those. It's a good backup pair. If these goes down, I can use them. Uh, just just for me, uh, after the sec first year, I was enamored with them. I thought they did good. Just had to go a little bit slower. But after two years of using it, I noticed that my prop my times were down pruning. My times are back up. It's just more torque. Uh, just the double cutting blade on this. If they put a double cutting blade on that, double reciprocating, I think that that would, what would fix it. Just like they have with their extensions, their pull extensions. I am using, as for my extension, I am using the Milwaukee fuel st system still. My small blower, my small blower is still the Milwaukee there. I'm using, right here, I'm using the 94Rs. I went back to the 94Rs. So 
we're back with the steel 94Rs. Still using the Milwaukee chainsaw. Um, no need to change that. Little Giant, we have the Toro and the Time Master. We have the um, we have the uh, the steel backpack and this is my this is my new favorite uh, uh, leaf vac. This is my new favorite leaf blower, the PB9010. I was gonna sell it. I decided not to because it just it's such a good blower. It's very powerful. It, it's kind of comfortable on your back. It is heavy. The tube is heavy. I do have arm fatigue. I know I need to lift fillets, blah, 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 whatever. Um, but uh, it's definitely, if you're thinking about getting this, I actually had bicep strain just by using this this last two weeks, uh, trying to clean up these leaves. So there's been bicep strain there. So that's my setup. This is what we're running with. You have the whole, you have the whole truck set up. Uh, just basic tools, Wolverines, right? You know, just basic stuff here. And we're ready to go. We're trying. You can see she's muddy already. Uh, you can see she's already muddy. So there's a little bit of mud out here. Uh, had some really, really great weather the last couple of days, 80 degrees. I don't know if that's a good thing, but uh, it's just so hot so quick. So, guys, that's my time. If you have any questions, that's the setup we're running with. Um, what I tried to really do this year is really have a backup for everything. I have a backup spreader. I have a backup mower. I've always had a backup mower. I have a backup truck. The only thing I don't have a backup for is a trailer, but I can always rent one if I needed to. Um, usually to get that fixed. It's only really, there's only a few things that go wrong with a trailer to begin with. Um, so not too bad. Got the trucks, everything's ready to go. The new logo. I got the new uniforms and we're ready to go. Um, moving fertilizer, moved a couple pallets, got a couple more to move here and we're trying to get through this, this first round. So guys, that's my time. It's been great. Uh, let me know what you think. Any questions? Let me know what you think of the logo. Uh, we just been running. We want this year. We haven't hit the ground. We hit the ground running like it's bang. You're right in, you're going right at it. This year's just been, um, about a decade ago, it was kind of like this, where the grass is just growing. Look, I cut that grass the other day. Look, it's growing again. But that's northeast grass, 80 degrees, and you know what happens when it hits 80 degrees up here. It's 9, 10 inches a week. So, all right, guys, that's my time. Have a good one.